a singing competition. Mm -hmm. Look at those jeans. They're awesome. <laughs> They're like frayed denim. Yeah. By the this, way, those are in again with a I little know, part. it's really wow. terrifying, actually. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, this was, I grew up singing, and this was, I'm assuming I was singing a country song here. Mm -hmm. Other, <laughs> probably not musical theater in this outfit, but so uh, yeah, that was probably a year or two before I moved to LA, and mm -hmm. I love it. I love where I come from. I, all my family is still in Tennessee. Yeah. 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 It's a great my mom is probably watching, so. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about the movie that you're in now, which brings me to you, which yeah. brought you to us. What attracted yes. you to this story? I love that lead-in yeah. line. It's great. Mm -hmm. I, you know, I've done some movies within the rom-com space before, yeah. but when I got this script, mm -hmm. I loved how the movie started, how a lot of these movies end, because the couple gets together right at the beginning, and you're like, yeah. well, where is this going? But we actually get to live out um, the past love stories and heartbreaks. We go back in time, so I got to play ages 16. I never thought at 34 I'd still be playing a teenager. Wow. 16 to 30, and um, and I thought it was really interesting that our characters kind of intercept the flashbacks, so we're a part of their stories even more. Yeah. And it's just Nat Wolf is one of my favorite people I've ever yeah. worked with. He's such a talented actor. Um, yeah. Yes, yay for Nat. And we truly, it was like the experience was. Lightning in a bottle. It was very yeah. fun. I'd worked with the director on The Hating Game before, and so sure. there was a lot of comfort and safety. Oh, God, me. tell me about, like, so you're playing yourself at 16. Do you tap into your Ooh. inner teenager, your old teenager? I mean, do you go back to a Bratz commercial? Do you walk <laughs> around? That's for sure what I did. Well, do you walk around a mall and study teenagers today? Like, how do you get back into the teenage mindset? I don't, I really don't know. That was really the tricky part. And you only see about three scenes of me. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay, I need to have really long hair. So I knew how visually we were going to yeah. capture yeah. it, but... You know, that's before you're jaded by life or like mm -hmm. your first heartbreak. I truly don't know if I captured the essence of a 16 mm -hmm. year old correctly, but you'll have to go watch it and see. <laughs> Yes. I didn't mean to shamelessly plug right. the movie, right. but no, that's what you kind of you have yeah. 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 But did you have a type in this movie like your character does? Mm. Yeah. Oh, do, does Lucy? Does, I mean, why am yeah. I talking about myself as a person? <laughs> do I? I typically, like my Achilles heel is um, musicians. I yeah. love kind of, uh, they're sensitive mm -hmm. and yes. in touch with their feelings, yes. sometimes a little too much. Mm -hmm. But they're also like a little emotionally unavailable sometimes, yes. which mm -hmm. also used to be appealing. But now I want someone a little different, I think. Mm. But but in the movie, Jane dates all types of men, um, so she doesn't really have a type. But the movie plays uh, out over a very uh, spontaneous 24 hours after the characters meet at a wedding, right? At a wedding, Okay, yeah. so what's the most spontaneous thing you've ever done? I thought you were gonna Ooh. ask me if I'd hooked up with anyone at a wedding before. Oh, oh. Okay, oh. it's so boring. Really? It's so boring, but my best friend is getting married later in the year. Oh, I'm like, okay. there's time. There, there is the potential. In the band. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody okay. in the wedding so band. Like a musician. Yes. Oh. Hopefully like the not a DJ. Singer. Hopefully not a no, DJ. Okay, not the DJ. Hopefully we have a band. Okay. You asked if I've done anything spontaneous. Yes, I have. Yeah. I, I'm typically like a type A, structured kind of girl. Mm -hmm. I yeah. love a plan. Mm -hmm. Don't throw any curveballs. Me too. Okay. But I was, I booked a trip to Bali last year and I went by myself. Really? Ooh, and, fun. And, and oh, you have some that's very amazing. nice pictures. And it was like, I, I didn't even really overthink it. I found out about this, it was a sound healing retreat and this monkey was um, really aggressive. I think he like bounced at me <laughs> after this photo. But, um, but it ended up being one of the really? most amazing experiences of my life. And I think spiritual? Spiritual, yes. Yeah. I think magic happens in yeah. spontaneity, yeah. 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 And doing something by yourself. You learn more about yourself, I think. Yeah, yeah. I think so. Oh, gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm hearing from our producers right now. We have one more question. Have you ever hooked up with anyone at a wedding? <laughs> oh, my God. No, but when I, you have me back next year, I am going to my friend's wedding, and that, that's my goal for 2024. That's great, too. That's great. Thank you. Which brings me to you. It's out in theaters.